Hi, I'm Singh. So today I'll show you if you're the beginner or you're the cashier or new to the food set, this video will teach you how to do the basic transaction from the opening to the closing. Thank you. Okay, first, make sure your iPad Wi-Fi is connect to the FoodZap Wi-Fi. Go to FoodZap Apps, then go to the declaration and key in the amount of your opening balance, which is your petty cash. So click on the pen icon here, and then you calculate all the amount, or you can use another method, which is to key in your total amount. For example, I put 200 and click OK and click Save. So now I got 200 in my opening balance, which is my petty cash. If you got use your draw money to pay something, let's say your bills or buy the ice if you are running a restaurant. So click on the today payment, you click on the pen icon at here, then you click add. If you are the payout, let's say I pay out for 15 ringgit to buy the ice. So in the comment I click buy ice. Then click save. Then we will show if you click the print report printer or the receipt printer, you will print out. If you don't want to print, just click cancel. Furthermore, if you add the cash, the small notes into the drawer, you click add and you cl click into in. Here you can change in the status in or out. Let's say, in, uh, let's say I got small notes for 100 ringgit and then the comment you can put small notes and shillings. So you click save. So you add another 100 ringgit. Then you can start your do your opening already. So you go to the click order and take some orders. Let's say I order the black coffee. If you got the add on, just click here, it will show it right here. So total is 4 ringgit 50 cents. If the customer is paid by cash 10 ringgit, make sure you select is cash. Cash. Then you click here, let's say pay 10 ringgit, just click 10 and click paid. So so the balance for the customer is 5 ringgit and 50 cents. Then you click back and next for the item. Let's say I order a lasagna, okay, for 500 grams. I click OK. Then it will become like this. It will automatic calculate for you. So total is six ringgit. If this is paid by the boost, so I click here. And I click boost pay because the boost is the exact amount to pay. So just click exact here, and then I click pay. So this bill will pay by boost pay and the cash roll won't open if your customer got some discount let's say for example then you click on the discount at here so when you click here you, wish you can select there's a preset in the setting called the discount setting then you can select on the discount by the percentage and you click OK so automatically it will discount 20% so for the discount preset you can change it from here go to the setting and then go to the discount, reopen or agent. So from here you can type the discount name and the discount percentage. So this button is the means the table. So you order based on the table. So you click here to change the table number. If you click here means the unpaid. So this is the unpaid list. And this is the paid list. If you want to go through for more previous transaction, you can click more. You can search by today or not today or you can click search on the device, the transaction on the device or on the cloud. During the end of the day, if on the closing, make sure you don't have any sales here. Then, go to the declaration. You calculate all the cash in the drawer. And then, go to the declaration, you click pencil icon here, key in, calculate all the money into it. Okay, for example, let's say my total amount is 280, and click OK and click Save. So it will show that something is not right and short off 9 ringgit 50 cents. Then something is not right. That's all for today. Thank you.